today I'm going to be showing you how I make hot water cornbread. Yes, hot water cornbread. Decided I was going to make some hot water today to go with our Easter Sunday meal. I don't really care for hot water cornbread, but my family do. I decided I was going to make them some hot water cornbread today along with our Easter Sunday meal. I wanted to show you how I make this. It's very easy to make. I already have my ingredients here sitting here. So when I make hot water cornbread, you normally just use yellow cornmeal, any yellow cornmeal of your choice. This is for baking and breading. So I'm just gonna use this one. You know, everything is limited in the store right now. So I'm using what I have on hand here, this yellow cornmeal by Quaker. So I have that. And again, it's pretty much just uh, cornmeal. And I put a little sugar. Let me show you what I have here. I have one cup of cornmeal here. I have about one third cup of sugar. Of course, I put a little sugar in everything I cook. And I bought a teaspoon of salt. And I already measured some out here in my bowl. This is one cup. So when I, when I add this one, it becomes two cups. And so yeah, that's all you do. Your sugar, a little salt, cornmeal, and I have my skillet here getting hot, and I have my hot water. So, we're gonna get started in making this. I haven't made this in a while, so I'm just gonna pour this one over in here. So, this is now two cups. I'm gonna put my one third cup of sugar, and I'm gonna add my teaspoon of salt. Now, you can also put a little flour in here if you like, but I won't put flour in here because this is already uh, baking cornmeal. Baking and breading cornmeal. And just kind of mix it in together here. And again, have your oil on the stove getting hot because again, this is hot water cornbread. For all you old schoolers, you know what I'm talking about. You know the cornbread that our grandparents and parents used to make when we was coming up. So I have my hot water here. Now I just boil some hot water, you boil hot water. And really hot water, you just eyeballing it. I just eyeball the hot water. So I'm gonna go ahead and pour some of this hot water over in here. Not too much. Cause you don't want it to be soupy. You just want that real, kind of like, not too thick either, but kind of like a, like grits. Add a little more hot water. Again, I'm just eyeballing it. And if you want, you can also add a little oil in here. So I'm gonna mix this real well. And right now I'm just starting off with a small batch. Now, let's see if you can see that, the consistency. That, again, you don't want it too soupy. You want it just enough so that you can form your you can make them into patties, pones, they all different sizes and shapes. You can make hot water cornbread. It's just the, your preference. Okay, so I think that's about, I'm gonna spoon it just with this. And you put this right in your hands. My hands is a, see that's kinda, just like that. My hands too, is immune to <laughs> hotness, hot water. And you just form them however you want to shape them. Just like that. And then I'm gonna just test this oil here. Get 
get a little more hotter. And I think I'm gonna add a little more cornmeal because this is a little too loose. want it stiff, kind of stiff like. So that's beyond two cups, but that's okay. Add a little more hot water in here. your patties and I'm gonna um, I'm gonna test this grease and you can make them big as or small as you like so just like that so I'm gonna come back and let you see okay here I have them in my hot grease they are cooking and you just let them cook for about two minutes So about two minutes on each side. And that's it guys, you have yourself some hot water cornbread. really don't take that long to cook. Like I said, about two minutes on each side. And then they are ready. Because hot water cornbread, it's like, it's more so on the inside, but they are crunchy on the outside. Unlike your regular cornbread, it's kind of like dry on the inside. And they are just about ready to come out. So let's take them out. They are ready. There you have it, hot water cornbread. Okay, this is how my hot water cornbread turned out. And I also have here some cornbread muffins. So this is what we would be having with our Easter Sunday dinner. Okay, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to leave me a comment. And if you haven't already done so, I would love for you to subscribe to the channel. Lance Lifestyle Living. So until next time, I will see you in my next video.